Hi, I'm meteorologist Tony Petronka in the Pinpoint 12 Forecast Center. You've clicked on the Weather Now link on a windy, very mild, and otherwise kind of dreary day. You know, so far, we really haven't seen much in the way of precipitation in terms of, of heavy rain. It's been more nuisance, light showers, mist, drizzle, some locally dense fog along the coastline. So locally on Doppler radar, just that. The uh, reason why we're in a weather alert is for later in the evening, we, we do expect some downpours and, and some scattered thunderstorms. So traveling uh, during that time, uh, you know, would be a bit of a factor here. And here's what we're watching. Um, you can see a line of, of heavier precipitation along a strong cold front uh, showers and some thunderstorms. And we're watching this to arrive here uh, between roughly uh, 10 o'clock in the evening till about 2 o'clock in the morning. Um, actually, uh, the areas in yellow off to our west, central PA, parts of upstate New York, now towards the uh, D.C. area. Uh, that yellow represents a severe thunderstorm watch. So we're not expecting severe thunderstorms here this evening, but some general thunderstorms are in the forecast later in the evening. So, so here's the breakdown as far as some active weather for tonight. Looking at increasing wind. Oh, it's been it's been windy outside so far, but we're going to see gusts, you know, 35, 45 miles per hour out of the south this evening. And again, the heaviest rain is from roughly 10 o'clock this evening till two in the morning. A few isolated thunderstorms after nine o'clock. I don't expect them to be severe, but obviously all lightning, regardless of severe, all thunder, regardless of severity, has lightning, obviously, and up to about a half inch of rain in uh, in some of the downpours here's a look at newport as of what time is it about 3 30 in the afternoon some fog low clouds a little bit of mist and some drizzle and you can see down at easton's beach you know the low cloudiness and also take note uh you see the american flag there and in, in the lower right they're very strong well gusty southerly winds coming in off the ocean that flag has extended we're getting gusts so far 25 30 miles per hour and even some higher gusts anticipated uh, this evening. So the threat tracker, we keep it elevated for tonight. Gusts out of the south, 35 to 45, some heavier downpours. And even looking at uh, at least a few scattered uh, thunderstorms sometime after 9 o'clock in the evening. I don't think every location gets a thunderstorm, but uh, that chance is there. Here's another look at the satellite and radar composite and this uh, fairly strong cold front off to our west and this is approaching uh, later this evening and during uh, the overnight hours out ahead of it very mild is the reason why it's in the 60s right now and behind the front it is noticeably cooler and we actually get into that cooler air by friday night and on into the weekend when we take this into the future starting off now and those areas of yellow orange and red those are the downpours and and some of the thunderstorms and this is centered on uh, 11 o'clock this evening, you see these areas of red and yellow and orange indicating downpours and some thunderstorms. And then we'll take you into the um, early morning hours of Friday and looking at just a, an isolated shower. So we do have precipitation for Friday, but it's more kind of brief and passing. It's not real heavy, what I would like to call nuisance showers. Here we are in the afternoon, you know, partly sunny, an occasional brief passing shower up until the early evening. Then the rest of Friday night is breezy, dry, and turning a little colder later Friday night. So here's the breakdown for this evening and tonight. And you see the wind increasing in, the, in that window between about 10 p.m. and 2 a.m. Some heavier showers, downpours, and some thunderstorms. By 6 in the morning, it's just a few leftover isolated light rain showers. Uh, Friday morning, we are starting off at 55, so it's in the mid-50s and running about a 30% chance of a, of a light passing shower. Again, nothing long in duration, nothing real heavy. Again, nuisance kind of stuff, but I would certainly keep the umbrella on standby, even though there'll be several hours in between where it's dry. Wind picking up a bit Friday afternoon. We'll briefly get to 60 at around 1 o'clock, and then we'll see temperatures slide back to about 54 by 5 o'clock in the evening and then turning a little colder. Uh, Friday night under clearing skies. All right, that's your latest weather now update. Thanks for logging in. We'll talk to you soon.